Caitlin Bisco. I had an ACL replacement, MCL reattachment, um, total knee fix operation with Dr. Shook at Ortho um, I am an attorney and my husband and I and his business partner and wife own Naptown Fitness uh, downtown, which is where we are right now. Uh, we have a CrossFit gym, a boot camp style class called Swift, uh, and also a full-time yoga studio, we have locations downtown and in Broader Bowl. So the first time I ever came in, uh, it was a Friday afternoon. I hurt myself on Thursday evening, so I got in kind of right away on Friday afternoon. Um, I had severe pain in my right knee, um, kind of the whole thing, couldn't walk, really. Um, I got some crutches from home. My husband had, had to carry me off the soccer field on Thursday when I hurt myself. So I was not in a good place. I was in a lot of pain. So my daily life was severely impacted. I couldn't drive, which was obviously really hard. I'm an attorney, so I couldn't go really to my office and sit all day. I sit on the 12th floor of an office. So it was just difficult to get around and carry my stuff. I'm also super active, so it was really difficult, I guess more mentally, for me not to be able to come in and work out. That's usually how I start my day. So kind of both mentally and physically, I was kind of all over the place. Um, I had the surgery in early May of 2016. It was ACL um, complete repair. Um, the MCL had to be reattached as well. And I think there was like a, just a couple of tears, you know, casual tears in the LCL and, and everything else. So it was kind of a, a full issue uh, there. The whole situation, I mean, it taught me a lot of patients. It helped me grow up a lot. Um, I think prior, you know, it was like very kind of obsessive compulsive about working out and needed to work out every single day, sometimes twice a day. It taught me a lot of patients and it taught me to, you know, I'm very independent, so it taught me to kind of lean on others when I know I needed help uh, to get around, to drive. My dad drove me to work multiple times. He used to come from the south side, take me to work. So my experience with Ortho was amazing. Uh, again, I said I called on Thursday night, or maybe called on Friday morning, and they got me in you know, that afternoon. And he kind of understood how I was, you know, that I was very like, I want to know what's going on, I want to know how we fix it, I want to get better immediately. Uh, he was really good with kind of explaining, this is where we are, this is what I expect, and he didn't sugarcoat things. So now I feel great, I mean, over, we're approaching the two year mark. I think for the first year, I felt good, but I also didn't want to push it too much. Um, now, it's something that I don't think about. I think, uh, you know, initially it was something that I always kind of kept in the back of my mind. I don't want to go too heavy, or I don't want to run too far, because I'm afraid. Uh, and now I think just taking the time to actually fully recover over the last year, now it's something I don't think about at 